is up guys today after 10 years my 1984 gti is back on the road again Yee! Alrighty guys, first drive of the GTI was going good, um, not going good anymore. So I came up here to get some pictures of the car, so I get a picture and all of a sudden there was this poof and steam went everywhere. So popped the hood, came in here, and you can see this upper out of your hose is just destroyed. So yeah, that old rubber is not doing so good. So I, I shouldn't have came so far on the first drive, but it was running good and I was having fun. So yeah, now I'm kind of screwed. I'm up here kind of in the middle of nowhere and it is cold out. It's starting to rain. Um, yeah, not fun, but hey, it's how it goes. But hey, I wanted to talk about the car. At least now I have plenty of time while I wait for a ride. So for those of you guys that are new to the channel, I bought this car just under four months ago. Um, it was trash when I got it. So two owners ago repainted the car and then it just sat there for about five years then my, the previous owner he bought it wanting to fix it up and it sat for another five years so that's why this is really cool because it's been setting for about 10 years since it's actually been registered and on the road um so that's super exciting um it came together really well this interior was really bad but like yeah it cleaned up super nice we'll get rid of this and yeah fix that up yet but like it came together like really awesome. So super excited about that. The paint is also like, you can see it, it it's not show worthy, but like it's, it's pretty clean. All I've done to it so far is just washed it. So we'd like to actually like wet sand some of this down here, clean it up real good. And yeah, see what we can do out of it. Got a lot of exciting plans coming for this car. A lot of exterior stuff. The number one thing, guys, look at that. It's like monster truck status right now. So gonna get it lowered. Um, I got new bumpers for this, which I'm trying to decide here. I'm probably gonna put them on for now because I have some that aren't chipped up, but really like to do your bumpers. Uh, I need to get the emblem there. Uh, I also have uh, new taillights here because those are cracked and kind of destroyed. Uh, just a bunch of small things like that. Uh, if you guys know the GTIs, so got the two stripes here, the molding down here, and another molding up here. So I'd like to replace all of that because it just sets it apart from the normal rabbit. And it's just kind of boring how it's sitting here right now. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think about these? I kind of like the white side markers because it, 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 it kind of goes with it nice. But this car is like total OEM. So trying to decide what I think about that. I have the original. So maybe I'll put them on sometime to see how they look. So get this painted i got another front bumper for that um overall the engines it's running good like at lower rpm it's it's a little bit rough but as soon as you get on it it cleans up nice so i want to get a fresh tank of gas through here and we'll see what happens so overall though it's doing very good so i'm just super excited just i always like these cars it's it's cool like this is where the hot hatch began like yeah it's just an exciting little car not fast but really fun so so my last thing, so this car is like 100% OEM, like literally, like you do not see these cars like OEM like this. So I feel kind of bad about modifying it. So I don't know what to think, but I don't know. This four cylinder is pretty boring. Just, it's my dream to put a 12 out of 6 in this. So let me know in the comments what you guys think about that idea. That would just be like the most fun car ever and just make this thing like complete. But I don't know. I also feel a little bit bad about that just because it is like super oh yeah. But let me know. It's just a lot of fun plans coming up. Thanks for watching, guys. Just get a quick edit here and we'll catch you guys next time and hopefully be fixed. And we'll take it on the road again. And hopefully that time it goes a little bit better. Peace.
freezing cold. Let's fix this piece of junk. All right, so I think we got the right part. So we'll quick get this thing fixed and hopefully we'll get it home tonight. All right, guys, we're back together. Looking good, we'll see. Oh, I better put this on. So I went sketched out about that lower radiator hose now. So we're gonna take it easy, try not to get it too hot and hopefully make it back. Thanks Derek and Marlon for coming along. So we shall see. Alrighty guys, on our way back. So yeah, we'll see. It seems like it's going good now. So it's kind of weird because right now the temp gauge shows it's all the way down. So I don't know if the gauge isn't working or thermostat might be open. So I don't know what to think about that. But yes, we'll see. Trying to kind of baby it here because I really don't want it to get too hot and blow that other hose because yeah, that would not be cool. But hey, we'll see. So far, so good. Well, guys, we're again abandoning the GTI for the second time this day. Uh, she just came down here and it shut off. So yeah, I think it's the alternator. It's been kind of it hasn't been charging properly. Tried um, push starting it, didn't quite get it. So we're just gonna go get a trailer because it is getting late and we're just ready to get this done. All right, guys. Well, we finally made it back. I actually kind of doubted that we were gonna make it there. Um, big thanks to Marlin for helping me out. Um, yeah, we had to jump start it twice because. Like as soon as you start letting the clutch out and just get like a little bit of load on the engine, it just wanted to die. So I just kind of rode the clutch and revved it like crazy the way back. But hey, we made it. So we'll get a new alternator in it. I just love seeing these two together. So I really want to one of these videos, just get some rollers of the two of them together. But that's all for now. Thanks for watching. Hopefully next time it goes a little bit better.